Hello and welcome to the Daily Mad. Daily Mad, a medicine channel for all medicine lovers. Today in this video, we are going to talk about how to know if it is a normal fever or a fever due to COVID-19. We are going to discuss why our body experience fever, cold, cough every time. How to differentiate if this fever is because of COVID-19 or any other disease. What we can do for it when we should seek medical help. So these are the headings of our today's video. During these days when we have fever, we get so much concerned and worried. We have a very big question mark in our mind that it might be because of coronavirus. But we have to be aware that not every fever and cough is because of COVID-19. Symptoms that are common in COVID-19 are new loss of taste, new loss of smell, chills, muscle pain, headache, repeated shaking with chills, sore throat, fever. If you have these symptoms, then the pointer can be towards COVID-19. Note that if you have viral fever, generally in the first stage the patient will have high fever. And this is not seen generally in case of COVID-19. Loss of smell, loss of taste are very predominant finding in COVID-19. But these loss of smell and taste can also be commonly experienced in sinusitis. Sinusitis is an inflammation or swelling of the tissue laning the sinuses, which can be due to bacteria or virus. Patient also experience facial pain, sneezing, sore throat in this case. Patient when having history of symptoms like running nose, sneezing, these symptoms are commonly seen in allergy. These symptoms can be experienced sometimes in COVID-19 and cannot be experienced sometimes. COVID-19 patients generally have extreme weakness, which is because of fallen body's oxygen level. A well-known symptom of the coronavirus is low oxygen level in the body, also known as hypoxia which normally leads to shortness of breath but some coronavirus patients with hypoxia don't experience this hallmark sign. A new research study explains that some COVID-19 patients present with extreme low otherwise like threatening levels of oxygen but there were no signs of difficulty in breathing. This new understanding of the condition known as silent hypoxemia or also known as happy hypoxia. Especially during this rainy season, we can experience fever, body aches, sore throat, cough, headache. These symptoms can be due to some common diseases in rainy season like dengue, chikungunya, malaria and typhoid. Likewise, symptoms like sneezing, sore throat, running nose can be due to allergy that can be induced by dust, pollens from plants and animal hairs. Also tonsils and sinus infection can also give us the symptoms like cough, fever and throat pain. and these symptoms can be easily misinterpreted as COVID-19.
another reason why some people get fever and cold easily. This is because of their low immunity that can be due to various conditions like diabetes, those who have cancer, those patients who have undergone transplant, those patients who are taking some medications that decreases our immunity. So what we can do in order to increase our body's ability to fight back these conditions. Start including fruits and vegetables. Also include vitamin D in your diet. Those who are non-vegetarians include fish and eggs. Vegetarians should include milk and milk related products. Drink water and maintain adequate amount of hydration in your body. Exercise daily. Take good care of your hand and oral hygiene. So, when we should seek medical help? Take food and supplements in order to increase your immunity. Do not self-medicate yourself if you suspect COVID-19, as COVID-19 management is done through many medications. If you are ill for more than a week and you got no relief from your symptoms from your home remedy, please consult your healthcare professional for proper workup and diagnosis. If you like this information, hit the like button, comment, share and subscribe to motivate us to keep posting updated contents and hit the bell icon. Don't forget to follow Daily Med on Facebook. Thanks for watching Daily Med.